Oh no, PewDiePie Cocomelon. Okay, that's not good. What? Well, would you look at that? PewDiePie is at 109 million and Cocomelon is at 109 million. There's no way to actually know how many subscribers both of them have now. We can assume that PewDiePie is a little bit ahead of Cocomelon, but now due to stupid YouTube abbreviating it, we will never know for sure how many subscribers either of these channels have. So, you know, by the time this gets uploaded, Cocomelon probably will have surpassed PewDiePie. If you look at Cocomelon, they seem to be gaining around 400,000 subscribers every single week, which is pretty good, you know? And PewDiePie, he gains around a million every few months, so by the end of this week, they'll probably be tied. Or maybe in like two weeks, Cocomelon will be at 110 million, so I think it's pretty safe to say, because I'm filming this a little bit earlier, that Cocomelon has officially surpassed PewDiePie. Even though there's no official way to see it until Cocomelon reaches 110 million, it happened, man. F in the chat, bro. PewDiePie is now the third most subscribed YouTube channel, but I mean, still the biggest YouTuber because T Series is a corporation and Cocomelon, can you call these guys a YouTuber? Are they a company now? Like, they're a huge company? I don't know, but I mean, kids are watching this, not normal people. <laughs> uh, so yeah, that's uh, that's kind of sad. The battle is over. Thank you for joining. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Hey everyone, welcome back to Frolic Friday, the epic weekly series where you submit things on my Reddit and then I look at it in this video. So let's begin. Reddit good, TikTok bad, now upvote or else. Okay, 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 okay. I'll upvote it. Ah. Never mind. Look, I actually have a TikTok, okay? Here's my TikTok shout out. Don't judge me, okay? I hate it, but it's actually a good place to post things. Where's my TikTok, the heck? No one really knows about it. Where is it? I didn't even link it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> TikTok, go follow me. I post basically all my YouTube shorts on here. It's pretty much just a rehash of everything, but I mean, look, hey, check that out. 14K, basically, go follow. After Facebook, after Angry Birds, okay, Temple Run, yeah, Fruit Ninja, after getting Rickrolled, nah, man. <laughs> Yo, actually, I want to comment about Angry Birds. I, there is a phone in my house with Angry Birds, no, not Angry Birds, shoot, Flappy Bird. Remember Flappy Bird, that awesome game? <laughs> I was a pro at it, okay? I got like 40 high score on the actual app and I still have that device, okay? With the original app before it was deleted, so yeah. <laughs> but this is accurate, man, oh my god. Timeworks fan art, no freaking way. So you see, guys, I asked for fan art and now we actually got it instead of the bad stuff. Look at that, thank you. Thank you for making my epic bird. I would upvote it if I was logged in, I love that. That is really nice. Thank you so much. Timeworks needs this. Unrickroll. Use this card to unrickroll yourself. Yo, I need to get hundreds of those printed out, man. Hundreds. <laughs> if you rickroll Timeworks twice in Frolic Friday, he actually gets rickrolled four times when he edits the video. Look, look. If you just don't rickroll me, all of it goes away. Stop it. <laughs> Sorry. Look at the bottom right corner. I'm not gonna, because I, I think I know what this is gonna, I, I think I know what's gonna happen. If I look at the bottom right corner, am I gonna get Rick Roll? Plus, this is the bottom right. Look behind him. I swear, Rick Astley's gonna be there, and I'm not gonna look, sorry. <laughs> I'm trying to get smarter with this, okay? News reports that there is a 0.01% chance of getting together rolled. Together rolled. Dang, bro. We should make that a thing. I'd be fine with that, you know? It's not annoying as Rick rolls, though. So, I mean, I'm fine with it. <laughs> I'm fine with it. Uh, they are commenting scams on my videos. Please upload this so timers can see. Oh my god, yeah, they're everywhere. Basically, they're just gonna keep doing it. Maybe I'll make another video on it, and like, if I find anything more about it, but, you know... All of these sites, they link you to bad websites, so report them for either spam or not safe for work content, you know? Every time you see it. The perfect extension for Timeworks, anti-rickroll. You were about to get rickrolled? Dang, I would love that. 
I would love that. However, yeah, I use Firefox. So yeah, I use this Firefox <laughs> only because I've always used it. That's the reason why I use it. And it's actually, it's a, it's a good browser, you know, like <laughs> it's good. It's, it's better than Chrome. Okay. It's better than Chrome, but yeah, this is a Chrome extension. Unfortunately, here's an edit I made posting again. Cause someone said to add a little watermark to the side. Dang, that is really cool time works oh my god i love that i really love that check that out wow look what you did you even put the gear in the yeah the cogs i love the colors you used thank you very much for making this meme master fortnite very epic hi time works why do you think mr beast did not show up when you search him who is this random person what the heck It's actually real. Who is that? <laughs> images, Fraser Harrison, Getty Images. That's not Mr. Beast, so I don't understand. Copy image location, hang on. I'm gonna go to a website called Google Images where you can reverse search things. It's very useful. So we're gonna paste the URL. What comes up? Nothing, dang it, bro. Why does nothing come up? Did I do it wrong? Uh, well, I'll just save the image and upload the saved image. Come on, drum roll. Still, it comes up as an iPhone. That's, is this guy an iPhone? Is the, does the iPhone take up most of the picture? I wanna know who he is. That's really funny though. Like, why does that come up? It's so confusing. What comes up there? Fraser Harrison, right, this guy. I don't get it. I don't get who he's supposed to be, <laughs> but all right then. Uh, just a meme, Nick roll, Rick roll, r slash time Rick submissions. No, no, no. Only do the Rick roll, bro. I hate it, man. Ah, oh, we're gonna be at episode 50 of Frolic Friday soon, and that's all it's gonna be known for. Come on, guys, do better. Oh my God, YouTube changed channel's homepage in Android after a very long time but it kind of looks like TikTok. Wait, what? That's very interesting. So this is the new YouTube mobile homepage. It is like TikTok. It's very much like TikTok. I'm gonna get my phone out. I'm curious if they've actually done this on my end. Let's see, I'm gonna go to my channel. Well, it doesn't show for me, but I'm gonna go to a different channel. Now, nope. maybe it has to update. Yeah, I have no update. So uh, I guess this is what YouTube is planning. It is pretty much like the TikTok layout. Like here, if you look at TikTok, right? I mean, this is the... The, uh, the desktop version, but like it's, you see how it is, yeah? So, uh, honestly though, I do like this. It looks nice and refreshing. It I like change, basically. And I think it's more annoying having this tab bar below the channel banner. I think this looks a lot more cleaner, and honestly, I'm on board with that. Good job, YouTube, very epic. Rickroll is gone. I don't wanna watch this one. That's one of Nick's dreams he had. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll watch it. Let's see. Wait. <laughs> no way. I don't want to play it because there's might be copyright stuff, but like, look at that, he's gone. There is something though, I do want to visit where these places, like these music video stuff was filmed. Like, where's this restaurant? Is that just a film set? I know for sure that this is a street, like an actual street. I want to go there so that we could film our own Rick Rowe video and compete with Rick Astley. It's a good idea, right? I know it is. New audio track on Mr. Beast's video. Upload this, so yeah, okay, let's see. So you can, uh, there's an option here to change the audio track from English to Spanish. That is cool. I have heard about this and I wanna make a video on it because I think it's such a useful feature. I just wanna, I think in the future, let's say time works 10 million subscribers, we have like infinite resources. Uh, I would like to go back and redo every single one of my videos in as many languages as possible. That would be cool um, so that everyone could watch. And I won't have to do any of the voicing for it because I don't know how to, I can barely speak French, okay? All I know how to say, we baguette, okay? That's all I know. So I don't know, I think that would be cool. 
This is a good feature. I like it. Uh, why is the UI messed up? Yeah, I noticed that oftentimes whatever language this is, Arabic is it? It goes from, uh, yeah, from left to right or right to left or whatever. And it, it reverses. I notice this a lot and it's so confusing. It even happens on Discord sometimes, which I've noticed. So here's the video of it. Okay, well, I think we have to change our language. <laughs> that, uh, <laughs> where is it? Uh, how do I even find it? Where is it? This one? Or this one? Or this? They all look... Oh, here we go. One of these, yeah. I'm guessing this. Oh, wow. That is so cool. Yeah, it was that one. And yeah, YouTube is completely reversed because it's in a language that people read the opposite way to English. That is so cool. Oh my god, it even reverses everything because you have to. That is very cool. Um, so I just realized that I don't know how to change it back because I can't find where it says settings or the language symbol. I can't find any of it, so it's gonna take me a while, dang it. But that is very cool. Like, I, do you, like, I didn't know until I was, like, today years old <laughs> that this was an actual thing. That's very cool. Dang, Social Blade is high. James Charles should reach 25.4 billion subscribers around tomorrow. Oh my god, what? Rough estimated based on current trend. Yeah, okay, okay. <laughs> well, I don't know about James Charles now, you know, after some of that stuff. <laughs> Ugh. Wait for this to come in Frolic Friday. Nick is dumb. Fact. Shut up! <sighs> Dang, bro. Should have seen it coming. YouTube in 2021, the image on the right is edited. What everyone sees, all right, 20 million ratings, 4.7, 17 years old. What YouTube sees, five star rating, four plus years old. Yeah, that's a YouTube uh, in 2021, bro. Coco Melon, Coco Melon. Everyone loves Coco Melon, right? Oh my God, it's crazy. Custom Timeworks play button. That is cool. I like that one. YouTube, can you send this to me? <laughs> Thank you very much to you. That's very epic. I would like to get that on one of my shelves, yes. I made it better, guys. I know what this is, okay? I can see it. I swear if, if it's a Rickroll, I swear. <sighs> well, we're gonna end it on that. I didn't get Rickroll today, yay. Oh wait, I did. Still, only one Rickroll, doing pretty good. So yeah, if you enjoyed this episode of Frolic Friday, remember to click subscribe as well as to submit on the subreddit. It's a pretty epic place. And yeah, that's it for me in this video. Thank you for watching, and of course, fly on.